There's no feeling at this conference of a task completed or a victory won. We know it's not over. Until we fix the addiction to debt that got this country into this mess in the first place, it's not over. Until we can help hard-working people to own a home, to save, to start a business, it's not over. Until we've helped the long-term unemployed, condemned to a life on the dole, it's not over. Until there is real faith that our children's lives will be better than our own, it is not over. The battle to turn Britain around, it is not even close to being over, and we are going to finish what we have started. What about the long-term unemployed? Let us pledge here we will not abandon them, as previous governments did. And so today, I can tell you about a new approach we're calling Help to Work. For the first time, all long-term unemployed people who are capable of work will be required to do something in return for their benefits and to help them find work. They will do useful work, putting something back into their community, making meals for the elderly, clearing up litter, working for a local charity. Others will be made to attend the job centre every working day. And for those with underlying problems like drug addiction and illiteracy, there will be an intensive regime of support. No one will be ignored or left without help. But no one will get something for nothing. Help to work and in return work for the dole because a fair welfare system is fair to those who need it and fair to those who pay for it too. Surely the lesson of the last decade is that it's not enough to clean up the mess after it's happened. You've got to take action before it happens. It should be obvious to anyone that in the years running up to the crash, this country should have been running a budget surplus. That's what we mean when we say they didn't fix the roof when the sun was shining. Let us never make that same mistake again. This crisis took us to the brink. If we don't reduce our debts, the next could push us over. Let us learn from the mistakes that got Britain into this mess. Let us vow never again. This time we're going to run a surplus. This time we are going to fix the roof when the sun shines.